going to be talking about camp oven cooking. What I've got here on the table is a big range of uh, camp oven cooking equipment. I've actually got three camp ovens here. Um, you don't need all this gear. I've accrued quite a lot of stuff over the years and um, I've got bits and pieces from all over the places but this camp oven here, this is a dairy camp oven. I uh, probably about 25 years ago was camping at a caravan park up at uh, Yapoon and uh, my wife went for a walk and came back and said somebody's down there cooking something in a camp oven. And I said to her, what's a camp oven? She said, well, let's go and have a look. As you can see, it's basically just a big tin with a lid on it. And uh, you do your cooking in there. The good thing about the Badari is that it's also a, uh, use it as a great fry pan. This one here is a new product that's on the market now. It's um, very similar to a Badari. The only difference is, is the lid, instead of being up that way, sits up this way. And uh, when you're cooking and you, you put your coals in the top to get your heat, with this one they don't come out. When you lift it off, you don't get ash and stuff falling into your camp oven. This one you can because you've got a flat surface, your coals on top, lift it off, a bit of ash falls down there into the camp oven and you've got ash in your food. One other thing you need with your camp oven is a, a little gadget like this. We call it a trivet or a tray. What it does, it sits in your uh, camp oven up off the bottom Put your pie plate on there. When you cook, you get an even heat source around your uh, your, your pipe tray. And uh, I've got one of them for each one of these camp ovens here. A few other gadgets I've got. This thing here was originally designed for pulling tent pegs out. What I use it for is you get a lot of coals on your camp oven. Lift it up. It's pretty stable. It can't rock and fall off. And uh, you lift that just on and off your camp oven like that. More tools I've got here. This one is for lifting the lid off the badari, or even just lifting the badari up. As you can see, lift it up, it's fairly stable, and uh, that's a great little gadget there too. And you'll see us using these as we're doing some cooking. I mentioned before about the ovens falling off pack horses and breaking. You get one of these when it's hot, it can be very fragile. You pick it up and uh, your lid, the handle might come off or something like that, it falls down and it breaks and um, you've got pieces of your camp oven. That certainly won't happen with the Badari. This is um, just straight steel. You can, um, it's very versatile, very light. As a matter of fact, you can throw it up in the air, it comes down, won't even break. This piece of equipment I got over here is um, very handy for those people that do a lot of camping in national parks. This is a, uh, a camp oven mate, and what you do, you put your camp oven in it. Heat source is a uh, gas ring here, which provides you heat, and uh, in a national park where you can't have a fire, then uh, this would be the best piece of equipment you could ever have, because in here you can cook everything you can on a fire with a camp oven. That's the equipment I've got, and that's the equipment I use, and uh, over the next period or so we're going to show you how all this stuff works we're going to be doing a bit of cooking in each one of these things and i'm sure you'll enjoy it